is Jarrell with Quantum Light Consciousness. Today I wanted to talk about upgrading your energy body into a crystalline body. Okay, um, so um, it's been a while since the last time I made a video, uh, probably because I had a lot of stuff going on uh, in my life. Um, I moved from where I was, now I'm at a new area, um, new zone. I now live up in the mountains um, where the sky is in 5D is awesome it's like a giant vortex giant sacred space absolutely amazing so I've been feeling really inspired to be able to create videos for you guys and actually bring the content back to you guys that I used to uh, release on a regular basis um, so this should be uh, the start of more content coming to you again and um, what I want to talk about today is your energy body really because uh, it's something that I have been working with, something that I've been really resonating with strongly, and being on that level to where you really see yourself as pure light and nothing else, like identifying as that and truly being the I am as that, that's where you want to get. You really want to get there. You want to get to that place of embodiment of who you are as the core of who you are, you know, as your soul as your beingness, as your existence. Like your existential body has to actually like make the shift from understanding that physical reality is also multi-dimensionality, all right? So it's like you're shifting worlds while remaining in the same world and then you expand worlds while still being in the physical just by understanding how the field is unified and understanding how all is one. So that's what I'm gonna talk about. Um, let's get into it. So, uh, yeah, I mean, uh, basically, um, the reason why it's important is because the reason why integrating yourself as a crystalline body is important because there has to be a bridge between y your, your light body in the, in the ether and your physical body in the physical. Because, um, of course, everything's light. Everything's actually made of light. And then, of course, what matter is made up of is light. However, there's a, there has to be a medium to where you can physically see with your physical body, you can physically hold in your hand something that's oscillating at a very high rate that is light that's also very solid as pure light. It's pure, super fast moving light. And the uh, best thing that that is, is crystal. Right? When you hold a crystal, what it is, it's plasma just oscillating at like 178,000 like rotations a second or something like that or a quarter second or a millisecond just of like pure plasma energy just spinning so fast that it's it's just solidified down in a solid crystalline form so like all crystals are actually ether and you actually see this when your third eye starts to clear um because the other day i picked up one of my girlfriend's crystals and i started looking at it and it was just like radiating just like ether and i was holding it in my hand it was like i was holding like like a sacred gem that was like literally just like it felt like it was about to start talking to me it was just like ah you know so it's like you know um crystalline energy is actual just you know uh, solidified light down into solid physical form Okay, so the way to bridge your body into um, crystalline form to bridge worlds and understand how to walk on multiple worlds is, at, at once is to actually um, do an activation where you see your physical body turning into crystal. Okay, um, so the most pure crystal you could possibly get um, is selenite just because that's pure white light down into physical form uh, that's just the way it is I don't know why like every time I've seen cell night in the astral like it's like saved my life when I ended up in places okay so you know it's kind of like a tote it's been a totem for me so basically what I do is I see my physical body as crystalline cell night okay and when I first started to do this I would look down at my body then I'll see my body like um, I'll, I'll be able to see c completely through my body as just pure light, except 
I would, I would, my body had like, you know, veins going through it. And all the veins were just pure white light, liquid, living light, crystalline light form. Okay? So, I mean, um, that's how you know you're on the right track is if you can feel the light moving through your physical body, you know, while your body's still like here, like grounded, you know, moving around, doing the things day to day. And as you do this, you get stronger. You get a lot stronger for any resilience of any negative frequency going through around uh, the ether or for around um, from person to person that may be directed at you. If you're fully resonant in who you are and what you are and how you resonate, nothing can touch you. Like you literally, like nothing can get to you. Nothing can get into your body. Nothing can try to force its way near you it's kind of like a uh a safe like like a uh it's like it's like a safe way that you use to make sure that you're always going to have yourself you're going always going to have to have you're always going to have access to your body and you're always going to be here while having multi-dimensional access at the same time now also when you do this you might start to see in uh, different realms you might also start to be able to close your eyes and look and actually be embodied in another world while you're still in this world, which is your inner world, which is totally, completely healthy and fine to be doing and experiencing at this time. Because this is ascension and this is what's happening, okay? So just a quick video, just wanted to, you know, uh, you know, just appear here and just say hey and just, you know, tell you guys I love you and I'm still, you know, available for anything you may need. Um, Feel free to contact me at quantumlikeconscious at gmail.com. Uh, readings, healings, uh, well, not much healings anymore. Uh, sessions, artwork, anything you may need. All right, peace and love. Talk to you soon.